Hey everybody, welcome to my, this is Austin here, welcome to my Let's Play series on The Binding of Isaac. This should be episode 6. Oh, what the hell happened there? Oh, I had my fingers moved over one. Alright, well, wasted my bomb and took some damage on the floor. Off to a great start on this episode 6, but let's see if we can turn it around. Again, still learning how to play. Alright, so, so it's like Pill Jar, I believe it's called. Or Epicat again. Really? Wow. So, another run with Epicat. Let's see how. I, let's see if I can do better with it this time. So, I had a previous run, maybe two or three runs ago. Oh, is the distance always the same? Like, let's say I move, flies. Okay, so distance is projected by how much I'm doing. If I'm gonna be using Ipecat, I need to make sure I am keeping myself fully. Bombs are key. Awesome. Oh, man, I'm just a winner today, aren't I? All right, so let's try this. Right, just and two spirit hearts. All right, things are looking a little up. This gives me a little bit of a buffer. I would have wished to have still had that key, but you know, not having the bombs, I think, should be okay because. In All right, that's what I was trying to do. Red heart room, awesome. So that's the secret secret room. There should be another secret room, I think. Let's see if we can find it. So the arc of this does not go over things, so I need to make sure that there's a secret room. All right. Let's go ahead and see if we can take out the boss. Again, everyone, this is a uh, still learning experience for me, so we'll see how I do. So, Gemini. I don't think I've fought Gemini yet. Wow. Dude. This is great damage against him. Tooth, and we got a spirit up and a HP up. Awesome. So let's go down to the next floor. We'll see if we can make this work. I'd like to. My goal is obviously I want to beat the game. So let's see if we can get the mother, our mom. Let's check for our hidden room, our secret room. Accident that that happened, but I will take it. Whoa! This fly is just uh, skip, skip the fly. This is the super secret room. All right. Let's go down. Okay, so on flies like that, if I leave, they won't come back. Got this grandfather fly. Awesome. There's a tempted rock. Ah, uh, getting rid of this last one is a pain. Ah, uh, stop taking damage. Awesome. Bomb and a key. Or say bomb and a spirit heart. Let's just. Oh, we're almost there. Let's 
see if we can find... Kind of a could be a bless. Oh, means I gotta readjust my whole strategy. Awesome. More spirit hearts. I'm liking that. Uh, the secret room is not there. Could be in here. Yes. That's what I was looking for because now I can go to the item room without a key. We get remote detonator. Okay, so I believe this now means when I place my bombs, I hit space bar to make them go. So with four hearts and three and a half spirit hearts, let's go ahead and take on our boss. Larry Jr., alright. Wow, that was, uh, Larry Jr. definitely much easier as long as you can get that hit range in. Cool. So, let's go ahead and go down to the next floor. So far this we've made in this Let's Play series so far is the Caves 2, or I guess Catacombs 2. Buffer of spirit hearts is gone now. Still need to find some keys. Let's see what happens if I do. Look at the curse room in a little bit. Let's keep looking. Demon beggar. Might try that. be able to go to the item room this time. We'll see if we'll be able to bomb my way into the uh, item room. Or into the shop. Uh. Purse, it looks like. You know, range on this is so weird. I never know, like, what, like, it doesn't seem like range is constant. Or if it is, I'm just not seeing it constantly. Bomb bombs, alright. Need to make sure I take you out of. Ugh! Bad damage.
like I actually don't need to use a key to get to the item room this time. I can bomb my way into this one too. Excellent. Ah. Uh. Rusty key. And we found the super secret room. Eternal heart, excellent. We will save that. Because right now we don't have any protection for it. So we'll save it. And then bomb our way into you. We got. That's not wiggle worm, is it? Odd mushroom, fire rate up, excellent. Chubs. All right, have not fought Chubs before. Should hopefully be easy enough. I think. And I took some damage. Awesome. HP. So I think what I'm gonna do right now is let's. We are going to play the demon beggar a couple times. Come on, pay out with something. There we go. What we get? Holy Grail. Sweet, so I have flight now. And yum heart. And I unlocked a new character. Excellent. So now let's go and get our This, this run is looking really good now. Shoot the poop. Shoot the poop, you never know. And let's go down. What are we going to get here? Catacombs 2, alright. Let's just check you. Nope. Let's keep looking. I think because if I stay out here in the center, they can't hit me, but that doesn't make any sense. But I have good distance, and I can go around places. Excellent. Ah. So that damage I took there, I thought my tears would shoot over, but I guess not. Also check you down here real quick. No, nope, all right. Just checking if it was the secret room. There's a chance it could be right here. No, nope. all right. So it looks like I am gonna have to use a key to get into the item room. now. Alright, that's good. good. Alright, one more.
lots of heart containers, just no hearts for them. I need to find some hearts. Child's heart. I'm not sure what that does. Let's roll with it a little bit more. Maybe it gives us more hearts. But still have not found the secret room. Oh, oh, there we go. Well. Interesting run, you know, we'd unlock some new things, so we got some new items added to the pool, we got the um, new character unlocked, you know, overall, I feel like I'm making progress, you know, hopefully we'll eventually get to that beat. So again, here's Austin, you know, um, sorry, sorry, my name's Austin, you know, thanks for joining me on my Let's Play, um, leave your comments, and I will see you all again soon.